<laughs> now, before you make any smart remarks, maybe I better explain something to you. You don't have to explain nothing to me. But I tell you, if you walk down the street and some guy's following you, you better walk fast. <laughs> I knew you was gonna have something smart to say about it. I mean, what should I say when my son comes home wearing a dress? <laughs> Next thing you'd be wearing pantyhose. <laughs> like on that commercial. Our legs fit your leg. They hug you, they hold you, they never let you go. This is not a dress. This is a dashiki. A dashiki is a traditional African shirt for men. To me, it looked like a traditional dress for a woman. Well, that's because you've been conditioned to judge everything by Western standards. And I suppose there ain't no use in me trying to enlighten you. I don't need to be no lighter. <laughs> that enlightening stuff went out with conkaline hair straight. <laughs> if your hair is short and nappy, conkaline will make it happen. <laughs> I don't want to know nothing, so I'm not gonna to try to tell you nothing. What you said, name this thing is a, a, a duck shaker? A dashiki. Well, it looked like a mattress cover to me. How much you pay for it? Thirteen dollars. Thirteen bucks? You paid thirteen bucks for a cotton blouse? Hey, Pop, this is a genuine import. It came all the way from Africa. I don't care if it came from Holly Celeste's closet. It ain't worth no thirteen bucks. <laughs> Man, what's the use? I mean, the whole world would come to an end before you'd even begin to understand anything. Well, I can understand this. This ain't worth no 13 bucks. You pay 13 bucks for a cotton blouse with no sleeves in it. <laughs> Listen, Lamar. And don't call me by that slave name, either. <laughs> what kind of name? Slave name. The name of a slave that was handed down to him by a slave master. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm talking about what my name used to be. Your name has always been Lamont Sanford. Ever since I can remember. Your name is Lamont Sanford. You were named after Lamont Lomax. He pitched 46 scoreless, no hit, no run in in 1932. And he wasn't pitching for no slave master. He's pitching for the homestead grade. Look, now, I, I know that, Pop, but see, I, now I've taken a new name to refer